Hi, this is Greg Driver. In this tutorial I want to show you the simplest way to emulate HTC Vive controllers with something you already have, that is keyboard and mouse, or better, two mouses. There are many VR games that are normally not playable without hand controllers. With keyboard and mouse emulation you can play games like Google Earth, Universe Sandbox or Space Pirate Trainer in just few minutes after watching this video. Ok, let's go through setup now. I assume your headset is up and running. PSVR, cardboard with smartphone or other. Please ensure that you have follow room setup. Driver for VR would start with Steam VR. Change hand controllers to virtual trackers and start driver for VR. Open device manager. You will notice two trackers on the left list. Navigate to keyboard mouse tab. If you are going to use two mouses, then enable only mouse emulation. If mouse and keyboard, then enable also keyboard. Mouse and keyboard devices will appear on the devices list right side. Driver for VR will detect each mouse you are using as separate device. For Oculus Go or Gear VR, you may already have one controller and need only one more. In such case, disable tracker that you are not going to use. You can inspect mouse or keyboard with preview button. In such way, you can figure out which mouse is one you are using for specific hand. Now assign controller to a tracker. For mouse with keyboard, assign keyboard for left tracker and mouse for right one. For setup with two mouses, assign each tracker to the proper mouse. When doing your first setup, don't forget to investigate how keyboard and mouse are mapped to HTC Vive buttons. If you have any questions or suggestions for a specific game, please let me know. Last thing is to avoid keyboard or mouse to interact with your desktop while you are in VR. Click mouse slash keyboard capture window. Then press F12 that will cause mouse and keyboard to be locked on that window. Press F12 again to unlock. Please remember that after game launch you may need to switch Alt tab to that window. Otherwise games or other app may use that input and create undesired changes while you are in VR. Ok, setup is done. In simple words we use model for hand position similar like Oculus Go. You can modify model in settings of virtual controllers. So actual 3 degrees of freedom of controller like Oculus Go are emulated from two directions of mouse and headset orientation. To emulate touchpad you need to press left or right button depending on hand you use and move mouse in the same direction. Additionally we can use mouse wheel to emulate forward backward hand tracker movement. So there is also possibility to reach to game objects. With keyboard the same rule applies but we use WASD keys to change orientation of the controller. This is not so dynamic but will work very well for games like Google Earth VR. You can make it more dynamic by making double press on those buttons. Last but not least is virtual movement. It is possible with mouse. After pressing button on the side of mouse, you can use wheel to move up and down and mouse movement to change position in space. Ok, that's all for this tutorial. If you need more information, have any suggestions or problems with specific game, please let me know on Discord, Facebook or site forum. Thanks for watching.